Solving logarithmic equations using properties. Some more complicated logarithmic equations will require the use of the properties of logarithms learned in an earlier lesson. Say we have common log of x plus common log of x plus 21 equals 2. I could use a 10 as a base of an exponent to get rid of the logs, but it'll be easiest to do this when there's a single logarithm on the left side. I can use the product rule to condense this side into one log, so my equation says common log of x squared plus 21x equals 2. Now, when I use 10 as a base of an exponent, I get x squared plus 21x equals 100. I now have a quadratic equation that I can solve by either factoring or the quadratic formula to get that x equals negative 25 and 4. Only one of these is in the domain, so my single solution to this equation is x equals 4. This was an example of using the product rule to help you solve a logarithmic equation. You may also find help in the power and quotient rules, as well as the change of base formula and substitution.